In a groundbreaking move that positions India at the forefront of global AI revolution, Mukesh Ambani-led Reliance Industries is set to build the world's largest AI-powered data center in Jamnagar, Gujarat. With an estimated investment of 20 to 30 billion dollars, this colossal facility will even dwarf Microsoft's 600 megawatt data center in Virginia boasting an unprecedented capacity of 3 gigawatts. This ambitious initiative is not just about size, it represents India's bold aspirations to become a global leader in artificial intelligence and data processing. Reliance has reportedly secured cutting-edge AI semiconductors from NVIDIA, a global powerhouse in AI technology, to equip the facility with state-of-the-art processing power. One of the most striking aspects of this project is Ambani's commitment to sustainability. The facility is expected to be primarily powered by renewable energy sourced from an adjacent green energy complex that integrates solar energy, wind energy and hydrogen power. This not only aligns with India's climate goals but also cements its position as a responsible player in the AI race. Mugesh Ambani had highlighted his vision, stating, quote, We can use intelligence to actually bring prosperity to all the people and bring equality to the world. Apart from the US and China, India has the best digital connectivity infrastructure, unquote. The collaboration between Reliance and NVIDIA was initially revealed in October last year, signaling India's growing capabilities in AI infrastructure. NVIDIA CEO Jensen Huang emphasized India's unique advantage, stating, quote, It makes complete sense that India should manufacture its own AI. You should not export data to import intelligence. To lead in artificial intelligence, you need to have the AI model technology that India has, unquote. Reliance's AI ambitions are further strengthened by Indian government's proactive approach. Recognizing the strategic importance of AI in national development, the Narendra Modi government has pledged an investment of over 10,000 crore rupees or $1.16 billion to support AI startups and projects. Now, this move underscores India's commitment to fostering indigenous AI talent and ensuring self-reliance in this field. But can India truly compete with global AI giants like the United States and China? The competition is surely heating up, especially with China's deep-seek AI models making waves by delivering cutting-edge AI solutions at a fraction of the cost incurred by industry leaders like OpenAI and Meta. India, however, has a robust plan to counter global competition. IT Minister Ashwini Vaishnav recently announced that India aims to provide the most cost-effective AI computing in the world, with high-end chip-powered generative AI or Gen AI processing available for less than $1 per hour. This aggressive pricing strategy could make India an attractive destination for AI research and development. To further strengthen this AI ecosystem, the Indian government is set to incentivize the development of foundational language models tailored for regional languages. This move is expected to boost AI accessibility across India's diverse linguistic landscape, ensuring that AI-driven solutions are more inclusive and impactful. Reports indicate that the government has already reached out to six startups and developers to contribute to this effort. However, the exact cost associated with developing these models still remains undisclosed. India's AI ambitions are backed by significant hardware investments. Vaishnav revealed that India currently possesses 15,000 high-end GPUs which are essential for AI training and development, compared to 2,000 GPUs used to train China's DeepSeek and the 25,000 GPUs utilized by OpenAI for ChatGPT's initial version. The government has also secured commitments for 18,693 GPUs, out of which 10,000 are already live as of January. To further lower barriers to AI research and development, authorities are implementing a viability gap funding mechanism to subsidize computing costs by up to 50% for startups, researchers, and academic institutions. Vaishnav highlighted that while global GPU access costs around $2.5 to $3 per hour, 
India's subsidies will bring it down to just $1 per hour, making advanced AI computing more accessible. India's AI roadmap is rapidly unfolding, with major players already entering this race. Under the 10,000 crore AI mission, next-gen data center, E2E networks and geo platforms have already emerged as the lowest bidders among 19 competitors for supplying GPUs. But what does this mean for India's long-term AI strategy? The Reliance project combined with government support marks a pivotal moment in India's tech innovation. With AI set to reshape industries ranging from healthcare to finance, India's proactive stance ensures it will not just be a consumer of AI, but a formidable global player. The global data center market is expanding at an unprecedented rate, driven by the surging demand for AI applications, cloud computing, and big data analytics. Currently valued at approximately $213 billion in 2024, the market is projected to reach $494 billion by 2033. Now, as India aggressively moves forward with its AI vision, all eyes are on how quickly it can scale its infrastructure, develop homegrown AI models, and leverage its vast data reserves to drive innovation. With Reliance Industries now leading the charge and strong government backing, India is well positioned to become a global AI powerhouse. Now, if you found this news report informative, then leave a comment, hit the like button, and subscribe to InConnect News.